tutorial is going to talk about the amazing variety of things that you can create within a QR code. But specifically, it's going to focus on the types of things you might want to put in your QR code for your escape room. The first and most frequently used tool with the QR code is the ability to embed a website URL. So if you are trying to direct your users to a website to find information, you can type in the name of that website under website URL and it will create a QR code that links directly to that website URL. This is the QR code, but it also downloaded the QR code onto my computer as an image. So in the case of the escape room, I can insert that image. Now there's another way you can use this website URL, and that is to correspond with Google Photo. So this locomotive is going to be a clue. So I want to share that picture in a URL. So I click the share option, and I click get link and I copy that link back to the QR code generator I can paste in that link it will create a QR code and then when people scan the QR code all it will show is the photo of that locomotive as the clue. Finally I use this feature a great deal within QR codes it's called the plain text feature and I just type some text to appear within the QR code. Uh, how about the secret word? So that is the text that will be within the QR codes. And finally, if you like things to be in different colors, you can certainly change the color of your QR code. But be careful, make sure you stay with darker colors. Lighter colors tend not to scan as well. So there are QR codes in a nutshell. Good luck!